Boruto TBV Chapter 9 Nine Tails is officially out, and as the title suggests, Nine Tails has indeed returned. Without further delay, let's jump right into the chapter. Inoshikacho is on the cover page. They play a crucial role in this chapter. Chapter starts from where we left off last chapter. Jura tells Hidari that we were following Uzumaki Naruto, but to our surprise, we found this girl. Shikadai informs the sensory unit and asks Jura what they want. Jura pulls a book from the claw marks on his chest and reads information about Shikadai. Shikadai asks if Jura has any message for his dad. Jura replies that they were following Naruto's trail, and Inijin was about to tell them about Naruto's death, but Shikadai stops him, which confirms Jura's doubt that Nine Tails' signature is coming from Himawari. Inoshikacho and Himawari are shocked, Jura says truly this world raises one question after another, and I like that and tries to trap Himawari using wood style. Shikadai stops the woods using shadow paralysis, and Inijin pulls Himawari out by using Super Beast Scroll. Jura is impressed by their teamwork and warns them out of respect, as their sole target is Himawari Uzumaki. Shikamura connects with Shikadai, and he reports that their target is Himawari because of the Nine Tails Chakra. On the next page, Amato is watching Kawaki through Delta's eyes, and he is also worried about Jura. Then we shift to Baruto and Kashin Koji's hideout, for the first time. They're inside Orochimaru's hideout, as we can see snake lights on the walls. So either Orochimaru is working with them or Sasuke took them, as he knows all of Orochimaru's secret hideouts. Baruto is ominously looking at his karma. Koji informs Baruto about Shinju's Konoha invasion using his toad, and Koji needs to be in sage mode to watch via toads. Baruto picks up his sword and wears his cape, another very good parallel with Minato. Koji asks Baruto to fly to the triangle, and Baruto makes hand signs for the flying Raijin. Yes, Baruto teleports to the toad, who has the triangle-shaped ornament. Meanwhile, Shikadai tries to get more information, and Jura tells them exactly what they're doing and says that after devouring Himawari, they'll get answers to why she has nine tails chakra. Once again Jura warns them and starts walking towards them. Shikamaru sends back up for the Inno Shikacho, and suddenly a voice behind Shikamaru says, Behind you, but don't look back, it's a Koji's toad. And the toad continues and asks Shikamaru to link up with Yamanaka Ino as Baruto has entered the village. If you are wondering why they're looking at each other, it is to avoid Ida's clairvoyance ability. Finally, Kawaki starts to wake up, and we get another reminder of his insane regeneration. Kawaki senses Buruto and calls him an uninvited guest. The village is under attack, and Himawari is in danger, but Kawaki's priority is Buruto, another low for Kawaki. Coming back, Buruto has entered the village near the toad and confirms Jura is indeed using the Mokutan, or wood style. Toad jumps on Buruto's shoulder, and Shikamaru connects with him. Shikamaru explains their new target is Himawari, and somehow the Nine Tails Chakra is involved. Buruto is shocked, and Koji can also hear this. Kawaki is behind Buruto, he informs the sensory unit, and asks Buruto if these creepy monsters are his friends. Buruto replies, why are you standing here when Konoha is under enemy attack? But Kawaki calls Buruto you are the enemy of Konoha. Buruto says enough, they're the higher priority. Kawaki says, are you mocking me? He was literally knocked out by Jura with two hits. Of course, they're the higher priority. But Kawaki attacks with rods, and Buruto easily walks through them. Kawaki attacks with more rods, and Buruto dodges it. He then closes the distance and tries to attack using his scientific arm. But Baruto dodges it as well and punches Kawaki to the gut, and Kawaki falls on the roof. Baruto is fighting like he is in Baryon mode, with as little movement as possible. Baruto calls Kawaki pitiful and asks, You haven't been training at all. And Delta replies, It's more like, How much did you train? Both are valid questions. Kawaki activates his karma, and Baruto's karma resonates with his. We see Baruto scared for the first time in the time skip. Koji asks Baruto to leave immediately and keep the distance from Kawaki, or he will lose control. Baruto flies away, and Kawaki picks up on it. He is definitely going to use this to make it look like Baruto is a way bigger threat to Konoha than these Shinju. We shift back to Jura and Inoshikacho. Inijin flies with Himawari, and Shikadai traps Jura in shadow paralysis. Jura makes a tailed beast bomb via his right Rinnegan. Chocho pushes Jura, which deflects the attack, but it creates a big explosion. Sarada and Sumire are rushing towards the explosion, and Inijin picks up Shikadai and Chocho. Hidari asks, is that okay? They're getting away, but he didn't even help Jura. 
Jura is fascinated by their camaraderie. Hidari calls them fools, and they lack intelligence. But Jura says something is driving them past their own survival, and that something is crucial to them. It looks like Shinju might become a good guys. Currently, they're very gray characters. Inoshikacho was discussing their escape plan outside the village, but Himawari asked them to drop her so that she could escape on her own so Inoshikacho and village will be safe. Suddenly, Himawari teleports somewhere. Shikadai calls her, but she is inside the tailed beast's plane, where Jinchuriki and tailed beasts meet. The voice behind Himawari says, good grief, I can't believe that jerk ten tails would sniff me out. Himawari turns back, and it's a baby nine tails. Nine tails says, little girl, do you know who I am? Himawari replies, your nine tails right, and the chapter ends. Kishimoto and Ikimoto brought back nine tails in the ninth chapter of the Boruto TBV manga. Chapter was phenomenal. Art was at its best since the start of the time skip. Momoshiki is still a bigger threat, and Nine Tails finally comes back. Comment below with your thoughts on the chapter and the return of the Nine Tails. Like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Meanwhile, watch my previous videos, and we will meet in the next one.